Today's collection selection is the Zero Tolerance 0055. It's a Gus Sacchini design. He's a, uh, he's a Brazilian uh, custom knife maker who uh, makes these crazy, crazy custom folders. Uh, and this is a direct, well, this is a ZT's version of his Airborne model. Airborne to me is an apt name because I think that blade, I've said it before, it reminds me of a stealth, some sort of a stealth aircraft wing. Um, but that notwithstanding, it's a very unique looking knife. This very angular handle is um, comfortable in short bursts, let's put it that way. Comfortable in short bursts. And that uh, pointy tip at the, at the at the base of the handle is really, can be, uh, if you've been opening and closing it a lot, this portion here can poke into your palm quite a bit. That portion there makes for a great unarmed sort of uh, combat sort of uh, thing, device, pain compliance device, I guess you might call it. Um, of course, you wouldn't want that leather fob there. But, um, so this is on bearings. This is your typical ZT build, stout as hell, and uh, very sharp and nicely made. This is a 20 CV steel, um, and uh, no, actually this is a S35 VN. I'm sorry, and uh, it's got this very unique triggering mechanism, actually based on uh, the innards of a, a Smith and Wesson revolver. Uh, GTC is for um, the knife maker, but SLT is uh, SLT is his uh, patented triggering thing. I'm not exactly sure what the hell it stands for. Sorry, but uh, it's this right here. This is the flipper tab, and it hides, tucks away there. Pull it up, nothing happens. It's spring loaded till there, and then you pull back on it, and it deploys the blade. Kind of an unnecessary complication, but a very cool one. Ah, that was completely my uh, my mistake. I was holding the blade in with my fingers. Smart. It's got that beautiful blue anodized backspacer. I believe that's aluminum, or maybe it's titanium. Who knows? I didn't make the thing. And it's got that cool clip. I like the clip. It's just a good-looking knife, and I bought this when uh, it was announced that it was... Um, that they were discontinuing it. I, little did I know they would start putting it out in all these cool sprint runs. But uh, when they said they were discontinu discontinuing this, uh, I jumped on it and bought it for the low, low price of 169 or whatever it was going for. Sorry, Gato. Sorry I got in your way. But uh, yeah, so there it is. It is the Zero Tolerance 0055. A knife I don't carry that often, but when I do, I'm always surprised at how uh, very utilitarian it is. This funky looking blade is sharp as hell, and uh, you can you can put it to many a great use. All right, there it is, guys. Have a great day.